struts. So yes. Can you explain the special features on it? And well, the special features on this one uh, is, you know, obviously the, the neck has a scalloped fingerboard, which means it's carved out like this in between. And it's got bigger frets, huge frets. It's got a brass nut. And this particular one has the big headstock, which I love, and the, the bullet thrust rod, which is a new update. Uh, vintage tremolo. DiMorzio Aegis 3, Humbucking Strat 3, which I was part of, you know, come up with the DiMorzio. And these two are Ingve J. Malmsteen model pickups, which are based on that one, but with a vintage staggering. Three way switch and uh, stock tremolo, as I said. It's an unbelievable machine. You can do a lot of damage with this thing, so be careful. What was the reason why you choose that scale off the fingerboard when you did it? It's a long story. I, I did it when I was very young. Uh, I, I, I was an apprentice in a luthier shop, you know, in Stockholm. Mm -hmm. And it was an old lute that came in. I had like this carved wood in between, you know, from the like, 16th century or something. I decided to do it on one of my necks that I didn't like so much, just for a joke, you know, just sand it out. And then I started doing it because I liked it, and I, I've done it since then, which is, I don't know, a long time. Yeah. <laughs> you know? Yeah, I think then we should do the sign. All right, so I'm going to sign this guitar now. And I write uh, what I always write. Play loud. All right. That's it. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> and there'll be some lucky guy again, yeah. Dana. <laughs>